Hey guys, welcome to our overall EDC, and today we got a Diamond Limited Edition Hidden Rooster Knife. Well, actually, we got a bunch more. We got a bunch more fixed blades for today to show. So, here's just one of a couple fixed blades. So, this each fixed blade has a nice custom leather sheath. Uh, I think the bigger ones have some inlays here. Like, here's some of the other sheaths I got on the table so like this one i think this uh snake skin snake skin horse hair this one's just normal leather sheath pretty cool i know you guys are wanting to see a knife so let's open it so this one here we got is a nice big thick blade this is a heavier one too so the handle it's a stag handle it's thicker but the ergos aren't too bad. They aren't too bad. But then it also has a really nice mirror polish clip point blade. So all these knives are made by Hen and Rooster. It says German Sale Seal Premium Forge. Pretty cool. Not too bad, I guess. Uh, here's the model number if you want to go check the full like list out or whatever. Um, but not too bad overall. Let's get to the other knives. Yeah, not every single one is a diamond limited edition, but they're all made by Hen and Rooster. So this one here is a first production run, one of 200. Pretty nice. Has this, I think it's really cool, stack handle, but this color on it, I think is really, really, really cool. And then here's a model number. Next one, let's see here, what we got here. This one's a more of a rounded handle. Well, that was the other one too. Not too bad actually. Fits pretty good in my hand. And then we got another nice mirror polished blade here. That it says Henry Rooster's German Stainless Seal, pretty cool. And all these are made in Spain. I thought was was a pretty cool thing too. Here's another one. This one's a pretty cool look, I think. Not too bad, stag handle. Brass guard. Uh, here's the model number. Pretty cool, some nice fire work on the back. Ergos fits pretty great in the hands, not too bad. This one, I wouldn't say it's the highest like grade of knives, but pretty cool. Uh, this is a wooden handle, not too bad. This one's more blocky. I don't know if that's really my type. But that's a pretty good mirror polish blade too. Ergos, not too bad. This one's a lighter knife. Pretty cool. <clears throat> Next one, I wouldn't say this is a... I don't know if I'd call that a clip point blade or like a triggering point or something like that. But another mirror polish blade. Here's a model. It's an interesting one. Different one. Uh, the handle shape's a little different. This one, it's thicker. That, I don't know if this is as good as the other ones, though. I wouldn't say that. Now, this is a limited edition one, but I don't know if this would be my highest rating. This one, probably, I, I hate to say it, but probably not the best one they, I, in, my, in this collection part. Okay, next one. This one's a really cool one. Look at this, guys. Holy cow. This handle. Look at this handle. I think this is a bone handle. I don't know every single thing about the, these. This one's a Diamond Limited Edition. And a rooster, of course. Here's the model numbers. Ergos, a lot better than this one. Really nice. Fits good, feels good, really nice. Okay, two more. This one's a smaller one. This is a stack handle, of course. Uh, I, that's technically a clip point blade, I'd say. Mirror polish, pretty nice. This has some dripping on back and front. Ergos, really good, really comfortable. I like this one. And plus, it's just smaller, so it's a lot lighter. Feels great in the hands, not too bad. Okay, here's the last knife. This is uh, another version of the last one I showed you guys. This one, I just love to look at this one. Holy cow. This is a ram's horn handle. Really, really nice. Holy cow, and plus it looks so good. 
Feels great in the hands. Just awesome. Okay, my thoughts on these knives. These go from 200 250 to $50. I don't know how much they are actually. I haven't, I haven't gone through every single knife before, so. Um, these are really nice knives, I say. Um, I would say they're more for collectors because, I mean, do you want to hurt some of these knives? I don't know. Of course, you can use them. They'll probably hold up. Well, no, not probably. They will hold up. But I, I'd say they're more for collecting. But they're pretty cool. So if if you guys are looking for a cool collector fixed blade or whatever, these are not a bad option. I mean, of course, there's others. These are really nice ones. And there's, I'm pretty sure, all kinds of options. Uh, I don't know how old these are, actually. We got them from a store. We got a bunch of knives from them, actually. But, um... Uh, yeah, these, these are just some of the knives in my collection I got. Figured I'd show you guys my Hen Rooster Bowie knives and everything. I think these are all my Bowie, my Hen and Rooster knives. I, I think so. I don't know. We got, we got all these knives here left to show. So, um, like and subscribe for more knife content. And, uh, if, if you are subscribed, you'll probably see some more of these knives. And... Share this with a friend who would also like these. And thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you guys on my next video. So I will see you guys later.